while you're shifting. 22 all miles per hour. Oh, I'm in pounds. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to leave it. Oh, dear. How are you, mate? I am good, thank you, Mr. Englishman. How are you? <laughs> all right, mate. Thank you. It's, some of us work in the correct units when we are in the US. It's something. Uh, that oh, is it's something. That is purely because the last time I was recording on this computer, I was in Texas. Oh, dicks. Yes. So <laughs> it is purely by chance that I recorded the last Saxthorpe video on my laptop. Uh -huh. Aha. Um, yes, I can officially say I'm now also recording on Saxthorpe. Because by the time not. this airs, episode one will. Well,. It is episode one. I'm going to rename the time lapse on episode zero. I think. Yes. Is it a complete fresh start? It is a complete fresh start. I um, just call it episode one anyway. Yeah. Um, the only thing I've kept the same is the slightly chavy class tractor, and you and chavy tractors. <laughs> Has and it and got and horns? Uh, no, it's got a nice sounding horn though. It's got quite a deep tone. Um, but uh, what was I going to say um, yeah and a trailer but that's about it everything else is new fresh nice. and I'm loving it it's awesome Awesome. I can just about see you over there on the horizon in the sprayer just remembering just how to a use GPS G course <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> the gigantic letter A has appeared and then it's what was it? Control X. I don't know. No, it's it, not. That's folding. Oh my days! It's Control W because you should be using VCA. I know. And you'd be done. I know. Isn't it Alt E? It, it, uh, Alt. No. Oh my. Or I'm, just do it from in the menu with like a heading. I'm just gonna drive it. <laughs> <laughs> I've set the. I can't. Control L. Oh. Alt L. Ah, there we go. Right. Alt Brilliant. W. No. Alt X. Ah, right. Now we need to just set the working width, which is going to be Control S Auto Width. Isn't it mad how after Do using? Do you forget? Yes. Mhm. Mm uh, yeah. Are we turned on? Yes, we are. Right. So there we go. Yeah, yeah. I used to have to have when <laughs> when when we use it on here. I have to have a cheat sheet open. Yeah, um, I just cannot cannot remember. Um, but I just don't use it anywhere. No, and I think um, I think we are going to need to make the swap to to VCA because yeah. uh, particularly for for doing jobs, doing solo jobs because yeah. we only have one sprayer. So uh, yeah, and. We are going to be spraying all of the weeds, which goes against the video that I did. But there is a good reason. There are two good. Re there, are, there are two good reasons. There's always, there's always two reasons. The first one is neither of us want to tackle mechanical weeding fields that are so big. Correct. And the other one is we make most of our money from the output of the cows, which means we want maximum environmental bonus and aren't so worried about the small hit in crop yield. Correct. Uh, which, was a, said. which was a comment someone made on one of my on the video mm -hmm. that, uh, loss of yield is not necessarily that big a factor no if it's not your major income source that, and that is a fair point yeah I was just I think, well you gave me a little preview of the uh data didn't you but it's it's mad <laughs> yeah um i i guess they're i don't know i don't know what they're trying to simulate the effect of because you would think if you killed the weeds you'd get a slightly lower yield reduction because the plants will die off and not go through the combine yeah um i don't know could be a mistake it could i could i suppose could be they have been known to make the odd uh yeah faux pas. Have, you know, we all have 
But uh, yeah, it's um, I suppose. I guess the, the argument would maybe that using a mechanical weeder potentially you're using you're disturbing this you're not even really disturbing the soil are you overly no I, um, I think the reason you get the highest environmental bonus is indicated by the brand of the sprayer that comes with it and who paid for precision farming that is a fair point um, and I think it's really quite sneaky that giants have done stuff in the background that actually makes it better to mechanically weed. Yes. Um, but I, I suspect the reason it's the way it is is because it's funded by John Deere. <laughs> yeah. And by the you know the sort of technological research that though they and the the university stuff that it was all linked to was probably based on. Yeah, no, which is yeah, yeah, you know, and that—that's it's fair enough. I mean, they've they've probably spent quite a lot of money to be the sponsor. Why, you know, you would probably want to encourage people to buy your technology. This is, uh, and that's true. And I, <laughs> and I've just realised that the um, what was it, three million? downloads they hit this week on precision farming yes yep <laughs> and then you've got to release that video <laughs> i wished it had come out the day before yeah i know oh dear but it didn't no so um yeah <laughs> but yeah but no it, it was very bizarre very very bizarre yeah, um, I, I, outcome I, I wonder how much um like sales benefit someone like John Deere gets from being involved in farm sim yeah whether I don't know whether it's yeah or I guess it's more I don't know bringing awareness to yeah I mean I I, I can't I, I don't know I can't imagine and maybe I would but it wouldn't be John Deere yeah. it's made me more aware of other brands you know, it's like you don't see many Deutz in the UK. No. Nope. Although I have seen a few driving around. Um, I think it's probably made me more aware of smaller brands that, you know, if I win the lottery and decide to buy a farm, <laughs> you'd maybe consider other brands. Yeah. You know, right. And I, I imagine that if you won the lottery, your 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 farm would have at least one fen thousand on it. <laughs> yeah. It depends, it, but yeah, no, it would absolutely. Of course, it would. Of it would. It, would. <laughs> it, it, it could be the size of a postage stamp, yeah. and it'd have a fen thousand with dual wide <laughs> tires on it. <laughs> it would not have flotations. I can say well, that for nothing. We we know what you're like. <laughs> It would definitely have wide tyres and a stupid horn here. Yeah. Yes, we know. We know. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, I am very glad it's the weekend. Yes, me too. It seems Although, like a long week. It does. Although it's gone uh, quick. I, I know which is very counterintuitive to say. Yeah, for me doing... and I, I generally these days don't do two days in a row in the office. Mm-hmm. And doing that at the start of the week was uh, set me up for a bad rest of the week. Yeah. Um, took me a, took me a good day to get over that. It was, uh, yeah. it was first world problems, eh? Yeah, having to go to work. <laughs> we have got oh. a tank slapper on. <laughs> the other issue is it is a tad warm. Yeah, windows are shut. Fan is on. Hopefully can't hear it. But yeah, I'm just melting. Yeah, same here. It's uh, <laughs> it, it's one of them. It's all, rain, 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 rain. Moan, 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 moan about the rain. Slight bit of sun. Oh, oh it's too hot. Moan. Yep. <laughs> what proper what farmers? Proper yeah, farmers. Or British people. Or British, generally British. Yeah, yeah, either yeah, or. Both yeah. works. Yes. 
if we're not moaning about the weather, we'll moan about something else. Yeah. Tractor is awful. Don't buy John Deere. It doesn't go <gasps> around John Deere. Oh, he said it. There we go. Um, that's my that's my takeaway from driving a John Deere. It doesn't go around corners. <laughs> this Trident is epic. Yeah. I'm loving it. And it seems to be getting through the field reasonably quickly. I think we've got a couple of fields to do at the moment. Yeah, we may have to uh, uh, swap no, these. Yeah, yeah, this one and the cotton field. Oh, Everything yeah. Everything else is still growing. Yeah. Unless either of us fancies rolling any of the fields we have recently planted. Did we ever put in the Mandago thing roller? I don't think so. Big one. I don't think so. I think we've just got base game ones. Oh, uh, okay. Um, isn't that one of those mods that always had issues? I think it did. Yeah, we've just got the base game ones that a lot yeah. of that that Mandaco stuff has tends to end up with issues. Yeah. I remember using one in FS19. There was a one of the um, bits of tillage equipment. Oh, uh, okay, and it yeah. Had all sorts of little bugs. Um, what they weren't game breaking, but they were just a bit frustrating to deal with sometimes. Which is odd for a piece of kit like that, really. I'm guessing, and I've never yeah. used them, so I can't. It was, it was all that comment whether it's the modder. I don't, I don't you know, the, just like the, you think it'd get fixed. The fact they were dynamic. Oh. Uh, so, you know, the wings moved as you moved over the ground and stuff. Oh. Uh, a little um, bit of added complexity then. Yeah, and that's, that's, they, they would occasionally just bug out a bit. <laughs> it's like the, um, talking of John Deere, it's like the um, sea and spray. You can always tell when somebody's used super strength to move one because they the wings flicker and jump around. I will uh, watch out for that. And that is the that's the tell. <laughs> I can't remember who I think I can't oh, remember. Is it someone who, who shared a video in your Discord? Yeah, was it Eagles? It might have been on okay. yours, I can't remember. Alright, so I, I, I do like, remember oh, you you super strength on then. It. Do remember you commenting on yeah. it? Yeah. But yeah, apparently not, that's I've, what I've happens. I've not used it that much. I um It's expensive. I, it is Well, it's like GPS. And my lo the logic for me saying that is I've just um well, actually, even on the Oaks, the with the Kubota one, it it brings in the sea and spray mm. menu from like putting the John Deere on, and it's trademarked still, which yeah. is fair enough. But it's the same cost. Mm. So, whether that's a thing with using that, I don't really know. I haven't seen a. I don't think I've seen Might. a cheap one yet. Uh, no, I haven't, because not that many have it implemented. No, I've got a, um, there's a precision spraying pack, and I can't remember me for the life who did it, but it's all the hardy stuff. Yeah. Um, and I've got that on Saxthorpe, and again, it was the 39 grand to add the technology, hmm. so... Whether I wonder that's if that's a... the real cost of the kit. Quite possibly. Well, I assume it's an add-on kit, and you know. Yeah, a bit of a retrofit. Yeah, it might be what it actually costs. It will be. It does look very cool. It does look good. I like the. I do. Yeah. Just close enough to see some of its spraying before you drove off into the distance again. <laughs> yeah, I mean it is good, but yeah, I keep yeah, going back to your to your debunking video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and for some reason I've never really used it that much. No, I don't I... know why. I guess I've ploughed quite a bit, and I've done a bit of mechanical weeding if I've caught it early because it's cheaper. Yeah, and I'm generally pretty cheap with how I do things. <laughs> yeah, you are. Um, 
and yeah, it's not often that I can afford a hundred grand sprayer. I'd rather spend a hundred grand on something else. Yeah, exactly. If, like you say, and if you can catch it earlier, early enough, not earlier, you can catch it early enough, then yeah. And it gives you something yeah. to do, doesn't it? It's a bit longer yeah. than using a 24 metre or whatever this is. At 20 Boom. miles an hour. At 20, yeah, 22 to be precise. Sorry, but, 22 uh, miles an hour. <laughs> I'll let you off. Um, it, it, yeah, I can't think if I've seen any footage of anyone using something in real life. I heard the Millennial Farmer mention it. In his most recent video, I think, said they were going spot spraying. Yeah. So whether it's a similar Probably. sort of thing. And I've seen the ones, I think it's, well, is it Welkers? Or, um, oh, who's the guy? I think it's Canada. Mm -hmm. And they've got the, the ones with the massive Borgo drills, 100 and something feet ones. Uh, Mike Mitchell. No. Oh, that's going to bug me. Arse. Oh, I don't think I've ever seen anyone using them. Um, I think the closest I've seen is by where Ollie Bloggs's GPS-based stuff will switch bits of the boom off if he's yeah. already fertilised. Yeah. Or sprayed anything. Um, yes. But, and we get that, don't we, now as well? Uh, yeah, bear with me. I am just looking through to see I've if I've got anyone. anything recent from them. I think. Do you want to swap? Yeah. Let me just keep on scrolling through my phone. It's not Bales Hay. It's not them. Oh, this is annoying. Why can't you find it when you want something? Because uh, YouTube hates you. This is probably right. Man. Can't recall. And I'm just wasting time now. So, one more quick You're just quick stalling. Flick. I am stalling. It's comfy, this sprayer. You just don't want to uh, run the uh, the loading wagon. Uh, Not overly, no. Um, oh, oh, it's I would gonna say really could, annoy me. I would say you could mow more, but we really need to clear what's been cut first. Yeah, I think that's the. Um, uh, and having seen how good a job you did mowing, it's <laughs> rude. Oh, you made some interesting pants. Yeah, I can't. I can't remember. That's it. Right, closed. I'm out. Um, where are you? I am cabbing to the sprayer hopefully nope oh I might well, have been in I am, I am out of the John Deere anyway and where is the John Deere there we go in, got it in a windrow already oh yeah, you good I would started then. doing that and you were off getting a bloody sandwich <laughs> it wasn't a sandwich it was um Last night's leftover pizza. Oh. Dirty. Okay. I seriously <laughs> dislike you. <laughs> Why? It's cold it's pizza's fun. awesome. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. I'm just yeah. I'm shocking for eating when I'm at home. Um, work. Obviously, I've got my got my little lunchbox. Everything's there, right next to me. Yeah. I can just go and get it. But I am absolutely atrocious for making myself something when at home. So I think all I had Wait. yesterday was some leftover um, pasta and bolognese, and then felt really rough of the evening, like <laughs> getting a bag, bad head, and all that lot. And I was like, I don't want to cook. Yeah, um, I, think, I think the plan was to have a curry. I was like, I just don't want to cook. Um, so here we ended up having takeaway pizza. Takeaway pizza. Nice. Yes, it was. Uh, yeah. And it's still just as nice this morning. Or this yeah. afternoon, should I say. It sounds like you're really looking after your body with uh, leftover <laughs> pasta and then 
takeaway pizza and then left over takeaway pizza the next day. I know, get me. It's you, a temple. You sound, sound like a picture of health. <laughs> oh dear. It's all right, just because you do running. I, I haven't done much running in weeks. You probably do, you've done a lot more than me, I can tell you that, for nothing. <laughs> it's pretty close, probably, actually. It's oh, pretty nice. close. Yeah. Um, yeah, we know what happens when I run. Yes. Things, yeah, you end, you end, up, at, end up at physio covered in bruises. Yeah. 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 That was yeah. quite impressively bad. It was. It was, uh, yes. I've, I've never seen anyone damage themselves so much at a sports day. <laughs> I know. Yeah, nor me. That, that was impressive that you were properly ruptured. Was it both hamstrings? Uh, yes. It was, yeah. I think, um, I can't remember the, the grades of the tears now, but one was significantly worse than the others we're talking about. I think one was about two centimetres of a tear, and the other one, I think my left, I can't remember which way around it was now, one of them was about six, seven centimetres of a tear. From and the scan. enough that you had gigantic bruises on both legs. Yes. Yes. From the parents' race at Sports Day. <laughs> yeah. yeah, things you do, eh? Did you at least win? No. No, it wasn't even close. So, so basically, you disappointed your kids <laughs> and broke yourself. Um, yeah. It was the, <laughs> yeah. So, all right, thanks for that. Yeah. Right. I just, um, I, just want, I just wanted to clarify for everyone. <laughs> Clarified, yeah. 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 Um, where am I sticking this? It's going in the blue one, isn't it? Yes. Got yeah. You. There's a there's about two hundred thousand liters in there at the moment, I think. Ah, oh, super. Um, yeah, so we can actually feed the thousand cows we brought. Yeah, it's probably a good idea, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. rather than them dying. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah. You know, seems like a good idea to me. <laughs> oh, it's always a good idea to keep your cattle alive. Yeah, keep them fed, and they uh, they tend to do a bit better. This is true. And they don't die, which is kind of good. No, no, they don't. We've not got... Uh... No enhanced animal system. No. Although I do like that mod rather a lot. I think it's going to be one of those that is in the... Every time I start a save yeah. category. You should do one of those videos. You, you know done what? one, have you? <laughs> no, I haven't. And do you know why? Because I'm absolutely useless at actually remembering. <laughs> I started yeah. recording on Saxthorn. <laughs> and I was like, right, I think I've got everything. And then start doing it. I was like, no, I haven't got that in. So I made myself a load of notes. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. And I, I think when I did the same video, I went through... Um, all of my I, I went through a save basically I think and mm. did it that way yeah it's just, it's it's just things there. that I'm, and what was I showing you I think I showed you <laughs> I can see you setting up a GPS um, yep it might to. have been mm. it was Court Farm wasn't it I sent you a screenshot of my mods folder when I was setting it up and you were like oh you've got what did you say? Power tools and and easy dev and easy dev. But yeah, I don't. Oh, what was the other? No, it's not that. It's um, lumberjack, and yeah. I always have to have. Oh, you always add strength, don't you? Yes, I like the fact that I can just double click, um, alt, but, and I can we, do it. But lumberjack has that. No, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, so why do you need the other one? The other one. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, I've gone away from... No, sorry. Yeah, I've gone away from having power tools and easy dev. No, you you had um, lumberjack and easy dev and super strength or something. I can't. Did I? At one point. I'm sure you had many duplicates. <laughs> I, that, I suspect it's the console noob factor. I can have scripts. Yeah. I'll have yeah. all of them. Please. I want all of them. And why does it break? 
give me all of the scripts, please, sir. And, uh... Yeah, but no, I've now gone away from power tools. I'll use easy dev. Mm. Power tools like... is, is a good mod, but you oh, only need cracking. one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's the yeah. important bit. I like the fact with easy dev that you can um, transport stuff. Have you tried that feature? No, I haven't. The use the the teleport function. That's it. Teleport, not transport. Um, yeah, because obviously, no, um, maybe not. not obviously, taking what you say. Um, uh, starting on Saxthorpe, you get um, seed, fertilizer, and lime, don't you? At the bottom left farm. Mm. So I was like, ah, I'd forgotten about that because it was showing me that I'd got. So I was like, where's that? Um, and uh, yeah, so I used the teleport yeah. function on that, which is quite cool. Should should do a video on that. Oh, there's so many. Yeah, it's not one that I've seen anyone use regularly. So no, and I guess it's. Probably not one of the main use features, I guess, but a lot of people no. use it for money, billing you can, vehicles, set the fields, etc. You can use that to teleport equipment as well, can't you? You, sh I think you can actually. I yeah. think. Yeah. No. Whether you need to be, I'm not sure if it's like stood in front of it or in it or no, whatever. I have no idea. I've no. never seen anyone do a video on how to do it. <laughs> Yeah, I get the hint. I get the hint. <laughs> it, I, I think it's probably. I think it's a bit like GPS and the all the offset stuff that I yeah. covered in that. People avoid the hard functions. Yes. Yeah. Um, you know, if you can do a tutorial that covers five easy things out of the fifteen that the mod does, and the other ten are hard, yeah. no one will go. Oh, but you. Well, they might, but you'll go. I don't know. Um, whereas if you do all of them, it's uh, it's much better. Right? Yeah. Yeah. You need more evergreen content on your channel. I do. I think I've got one. No. Yeah. Maybe two. The map tour. No, one. You you need you need more it, it, as you approach the magical number. Yeah. It will make a big difference. Yeah. Um, I was. Um, what was I looking at the other day? I can't. I had a thought the other day about something. I was like, mm, maybe. But yes. It's just. Yeah. Confidence. I think. Yeah. It's easy to talk it, about. It's... Right. I'm in a tractor. <laughs> I'm doing this job. Um, this is what I've done for work this week. You know. This is the time yeah. day it is, and this is what the weather is. Versus, yep. I'm going to teach somebody, and then running the risk of getting it wrong. Getting it wrong. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. I, I I get that. I uh, with some of the one, I I have made mistakes in some of the ones that I've done. Mm. Um, usually in Excel. Um, as like with this one, the other, with the with the weed one, I. Uh, I, it, I was more confident because someone else had already done it for me in some testing. Yeah. When people said, that's not what I expect. <laughs> yeah. Um, but I, I think, yeah, it, we, I think we spoke about it afterwards last week. It makes a big difference to how many views your channel gets overall. Because apart from a select few, not many will go and watch a one-year-old Let's Play. No, that's true. But they will go and watch a one-year-old How to Use Easy Dev Tools. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. Because the, the problem is that the one-year-old Let's Play is a map probably that no one cares about at that point. Yeah, it's got a certain shelf life. Yeah. Unless they've just found you and they're your new mega fan, and you know they're camped outside the house and yeah. w watching every video fifteen times. Do a mile uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> then you're 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 kind of stuck that everything has a shelf life. And 
it's true and uh, I'm you know uh, we talked about it a bit didn't we actually no we didn't you mentioned it in one of your videos about views and the new series views and then yeah. the following one's probably alright and then it drops off to, and I'm surprised with Court Farm how that's all of a sudden just dropped away as well I don't know been out for how long Month. As a map, yeah, about right. I'm surprised. I really am. I think it's because it's taken, or taking, longer to get to console. Yeah, you might get a resurgence when it releases on console. Yeah. Potentially. Uh, I, I, I had that when with Saxthorpe when it actually released on Mod Hub. I got a massive re-watch. Yeah. Um, like it, 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 it was like the same effect of starting again. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Um, it has made me ponder just to play maps for one video. <laughs> Instead of doing a map tour, do a, you know, like do a new farmer. Yeah. Play for a couple of hours to see what the map's like. Yeah. And then move on. Yeah. Almost sort of the. Because you could put very little effort into that. Yeah, you um, just load it up. Because New yeah. Farmer has all the kit. Well, yeah, or even if you had a directory that you were just downloading, you know, you've got your set of mods, mm. um, and you could be the ultimate contractor. Yeah. You know, I was going to say, I was going to say, whoring, you, whoring yourself around the yeah. UK, but that's probably a bit harsh. Um, I, I think it is kind of something that Pete suggested. Um, yeah. And, but I, I feel so, so I just like do like one, maybe two videos on a map to play it a bit mm. and get more of a feel than just driving around it. But yeah, it's kind of really low effort. Yeah. I don't but know. Really people like it. people like a progression, though, don't they? Mm. Um, I yeah, don't know. I do. if you I were hate, clever I enough with it, I, you, I, I hate really short series. Yeah, but if it was sold as, um, you know, if you did it and explained what the intent was, mm. I think that might have some legs, you know. Yeah, and you almost could do it like so you've that done. It's... Sorry, go on. You could do it so it's sort of consistent. You could maybe move some kit around with you. That's what I mean. Yeah, you, you know, have you've got your own um, tractor, trailer, cedar that you use on every episode. <laughs> um, yeah. But it's almost like your um, what's it called now? Farming the decades. Yeah, but you know, it's, so you. It's like a proper contracting thing, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. I mean, you could do like um, the, the the guy that works on Joe Seal's farm, who just goes off around the UK doing other stuff occasionally. Yeah. Maybe go when when it's pea harvesting or whatever, he goes off and does that. And yeah. Who's the chap on your Discord that does that in the states? Um, uh, rural. Is it rural? Yeah. Yeah. Is uh, in. Canada, he, uh, he, oh, okay. he contracts all over the place, but I think he works for one firm. Got you. So I think he works for a custom contracting company in Canada, mm. and then travels all over the place. Which is almost what we're discussing, yeah. isn't it? I'm going to leave the sprayer near one of the fields that we'll need spraying again. That is not a bad shout. Do you want to do some mowing and I will continue with the no, collecting? No, it's okay. Are you it's sure? Okay. You clearly don't enjoy collecting. I'd collected it all. I don't know what you were faffing at, to be fair. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, that's not a bad idea, you know, mate. Uh, yeah, I, I think the problem is that it would... You know, like um, you were saying earlier about recording ahead of stuff you'd have to do it quite close to release I think yeah I'd maybe pick like one or two maps that were released at the end of the week 
and record a couple of videos and yeah because I think otherwise you'd lose the hype yeah no I think you're right because you want you want people that are it's like map tours you need to do map tours within a few days yes otherwise it's pointless it would, yeah, yeah. yeah I think it would have the same sort of shelf life Agreed. I think, um, yeah, you know, you're, you're almost going into your uh, YouTube studio analytics and the search bit and seeing what's pop. Yeah, you know, yeah. seeing what's the top search map it's, it's heading really, that if, way for a. Have you, if you open an incognito tab <laughs> and go into YouTube and search Farm Sim 22? Yeah. The content that comes up is nothing like I would watch. Really? Yep. Oh. It's lots of American roleplay stuff. It's the okay. most popular stuff. Um, is it uh, Hudson's Playground, I think, which is a dad and his kid who do a whole load of, like, barn find, you know, heavily scripted well mm. I assume I've never clicked on them because of what they are but heavily scripted content yeah um, I remember someone um, there's, there's a there, I was sort of aware of it because someone did a Facebook post they were their kid played on console um, but their kid watched Hudson's Playground who clearly plays on PC and they were like oh if we get a PC will we get you know barn finds and auctions and it's like no, no. that's no. that's that's someone set doing a lot of setup work. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Because um, you know, people are like, oh yeah, if you get on PC, you can get all the cool mods. And it's like you can, but those are not mods. No. Those are no. a very creative parent who probably sits down and spends hours setting all this stuff up. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Um, no, that's right. And it was kind of, as a parent, I feel I should tell you that just going and buying your kid a PC is going to lead to disappointment. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And a lot of effort for you. Yeah. Mom, yeah. Well, Dad, one... this isn't how I expected it to be. Yeah, yeah. Dad, yeah. there hasn't been a single auction yet. When do I get, when do I, I've opened all of the barns and there are no old tractors. Yeah. You know, you can just imagine it, can't you? Yeah. Uh, Interestingly, yeah. And, well, I say, if you're, if you're a parent who's not into anything like this, you wouldn't know. No. 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 It's... You know, you just, your kids just told you that they, they, they do this and they find this stuff. Yeah. Yeah. No, it is weird. Like, well, I say not weird. It's interesting. Um, I think I've, I don't think I'm logged into YouTube on the TV. And mm. that's an interesting one sometimes. <laughs> and I will admit. You know, they that uh, they all the sort of first court farm video started dropping. I did do a car tech search, <laughs> and I was quite surprised how high up the search yeah. I was. But um, yeah, it is, it's, it's really it's a really interesting look. Yeah, because I, I I did it to see if there was anything I could learn from it. Yeah, and what I learned is the stuff that I do doesn't fit with what most of the world enjoys. Uh, yeah. I mean, the other really popular one was I'm farming in a hole with zero dollars or something like that. And right. they looked like they'd basically made a big hole in the middle of a map that had grass at the bottom. Right. And they were cutting grass and selling it to make money to buy more stuff to cut grass. And I got bored at that point. Yeah. Um... You know, it, it's where the um, the idea that I floated about wanting to do something on a map like No Man's Land came from. Because the other thing you see a lot of is I farmed for a hundred days or whatever. Yeah. Or I became a millionaire. Yeah. And they're all based on those kind of maps. Yeah. 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 No, absolutely. Um, um, there's a chap called. I am shocking for names today. I want to uh, elf farming dad posting my Discord a lot. Posts his videos mm -hmm. like my Discord, um, and he has recently started one on No Man's Land. I think Land I know who you mean. Doing a 
uh, chicken farm. Yes, yes, ten yeah. million uh, chicken farm. So, and that's really cool. And do you know what got me? They're like eight to sort. I think the the first one was about eight minutes long, and I think you know twelve, fifteen minutes, something like that. I've gone past the turning for the jet wash. Um, but the editing, they're so. It's so slick that you know he's not like we're doing now. He's not rambling on, going through a job. He's doing yeah. bits of a job, showing you him doing it somewhat. Um, but it's cool because he can make money from like chopping down trees or or whatever and and selling crops. But it only counts towards the challenge when it's come from a chicken. Okay. So it's either eggs or selling excess chickens. So. So he make, yeah. So it's quite he, a cool idea, isn't it? It is, and you know, so he can make money from cutting down trees, um, to buy stuff, to buy stuff, but it doesn't count towards the challenge, uh, yeah. unless it's actually from a chicken, which that's very clever. Which is a very clever idea, and it's brilliantly put together, and, yeah. and that's what got me was the editing of it. Um, I was like, well, that's quite an interesting, yeah, sort of different challenge mm. it's definitely an interesting thing to look through as to what's pop because it's not you know like you know being from the uk you think oh it's going to be dagoin and it's going to be mm. you know but no it, it's the squad which i guess a lot of people have heard of with their role play stuff yeah it's this hudson's playground one and then just really random stuff that i would never have thought of existed and was mega popular yeah uh, it's um, yeah, it's bizarre what mm. it randomly serves you as well sometimes, and it's like, oh, that actually looks quite cool. Um, yeah. How are you getting on? You missed I've a got, bit. I always miss bits. Why don't no, you, you come over and tidy everything up? No, you missed a swathe of weeds. Oh, I did, didn't I? Oh well. <laughs> Good enough. Uh, I was talking about the video the other day. Um, Ollie blogs when they'd missed a quarter of, like, not quarter, they'd missed a section of a field, whether they'd abandoned it due to weather and then forgot to go yeah. back and finish that, it. That, that was it. There's, I had to stop because the weather was getting bad. I was getting, yeah, I was getting yeah, bogged right down on the, on the narrow tires. So. Right, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> narrow tires. Yeah. It was, now with, I know with, you're with telling the, porkies. With, well, no, because the spray has got narrows on. Oh. You raise me up. So the opening doors have collisions. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> I went to open a barn door. Oh. And it lifted me up, which is why we I do was... have another loading wagon. We do. So I'm trying to find a tractor. And plenty of tractors. The only guess you. I, I'm half expecting you to appear with a big bud, but you know. Ooh. No, I haven't had my nope. fence fixed for a while. No, I was going to say you've gone for the other really obvious choice. Yeah. Uh, it, it handles about as well as this John Deere, so, you know, <laughs> the next time I have to do a proper job in this, I'm switching the tyres. Yeah, I think, um, yeah, I think you, that's a fair comment. I think we'll do that. Yeah, the, uh, oh, I'm full. The, the floater tyres are not good. No. Actually, I'm half tempted to swap them as I run back to the farm. Uh, I'll have a play with Aaron. I'm, uh, are you sure we've got a workshop? Oh, we have. It's the driving one. Yeah. The driving one? The portable it's, one. Uh, haven't we got a proper workshop as well? I don't know. I'm not 100% sure we have. I, I think we looked before. I thought we had one near the jet wash. I, yeah, I think we thought it was, but I don't think it is. That okay. makes any form of sense. I'm going to have a quick look-see. You probably will really benefit from swapping yours over. <laughs> I laugh it's just as bad still. As you never bothered with the edited version that I made for you. Did I not? Which would go no, which would go round corners. It it went round corners almost like it was on metal tracks. It was uh Oh. I, no, I don't think we've actually got a workshop, right? Okay. We've got Must a wardrobe. 
It must be just the trailer. Unless there's one. Nope. Nope, I don't think we have. Okay. Trailer it is. Which means if I need to remember how to use that. If you could sort the trailer out, please, then I will come along and uh, make use of it. Yar. Seems fair. Yes, a little. A uh, 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 little. We might okay. need to get the, uh, the 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 blower thing fixed. The blower thing. Yeah, for the silo. <laughs> I might I might have done what we were talking about yesterday and uh, driven straight over it. Smacked into it a little bit hard. Yes. Uh, right. No. Can you remember how to unfold? I can't remember if you have to enter the trailer. Yes, you have to get out, don't you? I think you get in the trailer. Active, activate service function. Yep. Da, 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 da. That's the jobby. Woo! Oh, no. You. Uh. Do it. No, I'm in there. No. Oh. Uh, I'll get out of it then. I only got lizard options. Have we gone for. Oh. It's that long since we. Uh... Yeah. I'm going to go for really quite weird. I'm going to repair it as well while I'm here. Oh. American. What you got for twin road crops? Yeah. <laughs> oh dear. I wonder if that will behave better. Quite maybe. Quite maybe. That's... Quite maybe, yeah. It's only got lizard tyre options. Oh, so, bizarre. Yeah. We'll see. And then I will see what you turn up with when you eventually make it down to do some work. <laughs> I'm just trying to... Yep, you're, you're just wagon. trying. Just trying. Just very trying, yes. Very. Uh, R. R for repair. R for repair. And cost more. Customise. That, that went round the corner much better. Oh, I could put weights on it. Floaters with weights. Yeah. Uh, That'll help. Right. My tyres and weights. <laughs> I think I might have weights on mine as well. <laughs> it's a little bit stuttery. Getting a bit of lag. With me yeah. clicking through. That could be. Wow. They weren't cheap, were they? <laughs> oh, you wait until you see. I... I can only imagine. I'm on my way. <laughs> so, half expected you to appear in a big bud, so it's not, it's not going to be as bad as it could be. <laughs> it could be a lot worse, yeah. I guess you could have triples on there now. <clears throat> oh. Jesus. <laughs> Are you going to be able to get close enough to the silo to actually empty? Yeah. Of course, Cam. You see my driving? I have. That's what I asked. <laughs> I think there's a reason that people refer to you crashing quite a lot. <laughs> I don't get that. I don't get that at all. It's no? Highly unfair. Clearly, just being bullied, obviously. Yeah, pick it on me. Come on, then. Hurry up. Come in. 39 mile an hour. I'm on my way. You probably help crashed us on already. the way, dear. Well, help in the loosest term. <laughs> it does handle a lot better, to be fair. Yeah. These are much better. Yeah, I think. Um... Oh, jeez. It's Mike Mitchell. 
<laughs> I'm not sh quite sure what the turning circle is going to be. I may need to skip rows. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Perfect grass working tractor, huh? Yeah, exactly. Not gonna rip not gonna rip it up with this uh low compaction. Yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, compaction. Low compaction, because you've got ten wheels. <laughs> so I am guessing that the can we we can talk about it, can't we? Because somebody Mr Alien has shared it. We can talk about it existing, yes. So it exists in Terra Life, doesn't it? Yep. Oh, okay. Yep. Yes. Did you read? Um, I can't even. I can't remember if you. If you, oh, start that. Spiel again. Back in, love. Not with take fucking from Wish dot com. Um, did you see what I said about um, how the people I was watching on YouTube are harvested? Yes, I did. Very bizarre. Counterclockwise. Counter anti-clockwise, I'm not. Um and yeah, first missing the outside headland. Mm. Harvesting the inside one. So it cleared the tram line for the tractor. And then they do like a course play style well it'd be a yeah. cut out when they were full to uh unload into the tractor. Mm. I was like, oh yeah, I, mean, I guess in the real world. The headlands are usually pretty ropey, aren't they? So, yeah, and I think I can't remember what pretty rope. It was um, it was Wardy's waffle, um, yeah. and I think they've got some interesting uh, soil conditions. So, um, yeah, they sort of have to be careful. I mean, they do a lot of. Are you full? Yes, you are. Um, I mean, they do a lot of sugar beet, and you see the state of the headlands. Mm. Where obviously the Mahusive harvesters and all the tractors have been so yeah. yeah they have to sort of well I guess any farmer just has to think about what they're actually doing to yeah, the ground beneath them really interesting because like you wouldn't want to do this and just drive diagonally across the field to get off it because you're going to compact a random strip across the field I think um, I don't know grass work you know, you watch like Tom Pemberton or something. Yeah. They seem to just sort of dive off um, on, from the chopper, along, and then yeah. along with the added crop destruction that's coming. Yeah, true. Because it previewed that a few times. You're not just going to want to drive across unknown grass, for example. Yeah, because you're going yeah, to destroy it. Yeah, it's going to take a lot of thinking about. Mm. I guess maybe yeah. you'd have to run then to the headland, yeah, and go around that way rather than sort yeah, of just like down yeah. the tram lines and then off, yeah, around yeah, the headland. Yeah. It's going to take some thinking about, isn't it? It will. It will. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, the whole thing is the whole thing is just going to it's going to be com a completely different game. I think. It's, oh yeah, it, I it's mean, not at all going to be like playing FS twenty two. No, and I think from what uh, the two, maybe three uh, streams that I've caught, I was just like, and I think I've said to you before, I'm not even going to try and get my head around it yet until I can actually play it. Mm. You know, I think it to, will like, get wow. better when he, but I, a when I start again. Yeah. Which, was going to be yesterday but then we had a team meeting instead oh, yeah. um so i'm hoping to start again next week but when we move to the beta test map rather than the alpha test map mm -hmm. and it's hopefully got a lot more features implemented properly and working rather than us going well it'll sort of work like this <laughs> yeah this is um, what it should do yeah yeah that should be when people can start to get an idea of what it's going to be like to play it yeah because you know in the little bits that i've done i really don't have a comprehension for the the whole thing no i know what you mean yeah um i mean so we yesterday we, we were talking about soil compaction a lot yesterday uh, mm -hmm. just understanding how much is going into that is and it's one feature yeah 
um, out of many. It's, <laughs> it's nuts. Yeah. So it, 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 I think it's going to be like playing FS25. Yeah. In terms of in terms of the change, the how how much of a change it'll be. Yeah. 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 It's you know the the animal systems changing. We've shown a bunch of stuff about how crop things are potentially changing. Um, yeah. I'm being slightly hesitant because I can't remember what I can and can't say. So. Yeah, don't get yourself in trouble. Um, yeah. I mean, that was that was a really nice thing about Paul sharing the soil compaction picture. Yes. Yeah. I that's... can talk about it. He's shared it on Facebook. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, it gives you free reign then, doesn't it? Yep. Yep. Yeah, I don't have to ask at that point. No, just follow his lead. Yeah. Um, and before I head back, yeah, you should get all that in. I think so. Yeah, I should do. Okay, I'll they're put quite short away. runs, aren't they? Yeah. How are we doing in the? Wow, decent amount of six hundred thousand liters. Oh, yeah, that's all right then. So we just need to make some hay soon. We have our grass field, don't we? Yeah. It will be in a half decent. I mean, this this yields loads, doesn't it? It does. And there are there is more we could mow, to be fair. Yeah, I mean, you said last week, where are you going? I was like, I'm not. I was like, you could go all the way up to the BGA. Yeah, the you? headland but, is uh, ridiculous around that field. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I think we're good for um, grassland. Uh, yeah, right, I guess I do? next job. Do any of, none of the fields need fertilising, do they? No, this planted. should be okay. So I guess hay is probably the next job, isn't it? And then passing time. Yes, getting to harvest into your favourite bit. Yeah. Well, yeah. Actually, you do love a harvest. I do love there, a harvest. There is a contract as well, which is your other favourite bit, obviously. <laughs> um, We've got about a million quid-ish sat in. Well, random other things, but ethanol. Ethanol. Ethanol, half a million quid. We should probably sell that then, shouldn't we? Yeah. Is it worth us selling it now? Transporting it? Well, as well, as, well best price best. was best price was March, um, and it's dropping. So okay, so first first thing next week. Make a note of that then. <laughs> yes, boss. And it's well, mind you, it's still running. So maybe what we do is advance through to. May the next time mm -hmm. feed the cattle. Still got a lot in there, haven't we? Yeah, that's what I mean. Um, we'll advance to May because what are we on two day months, yeah, something like that. Um, and then we can switch that over. Is the price going to properly plummet? Let's have a scroll and have a look. Ethanol. Uh. No, actually, <laughs> we are waiting until May. Okay, because it's going to jump up. Wow. It's going to jump up. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's the plan then. We'll yep. advance to May. Get rich. Get retire. rich. Retire. <laughs> Harvest everything and retire. And have a big so, barbecue. Yeah, because we have got a barbecue, I think, haven't we? And we've got a lot of beef. We have got a lot of beef. A lot of beef. I this tractor is so much better with these skinny little wheels on it. Mine is awesome as well. I don't think it needs the stupid weight on it now, although it does let it has a bit of a haunch to it now. Yeah, it probably gives it quite an aggressive start. <laughs> I think the black and the uh, yeah the sl the sloping nose yeah is quite impressive. Where are I you? I guess I'm just unloading. I guess uh, two things. We didn't do a thumbnail. Just thinking the same, yeah. And we should probably return the big buds at this point because I don't think we're going to use them again, are we? 
No, I think that, yeah, everything is planted, isn't it? Uh, you check that. I'm just going to check. Uh, everything is planted and growing. Uh, yeah, because that's grass. So, yeah, everything's planted. Okay. So, I they think we can... Oh, go in. They have gone. Sad times. Sad, sad times, indeed. Yeah. Still got your I cowboy hat on. <laughs> Duh. Duh. Have I still... Have, I, I'm, I'm half surprised I'm not in a uh, horseman mode still. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, I did have to make sure I was out of that for uh, racking on recording with other things. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're doing quite well for about an hour-ish, aren't we? That's not too shabby. Yeah. We, uh... I guess the milk's auto-selling, isn't it? So it is, indeed. Now we've got a half-decent amount of food and some straw. So that's okay. BGA is processing and selling as we go, so that's okay. I think we we've can... Got some TMR, be, yeah. If we need it, the silage is looking good. Silaging, I think we're good. We are in a decent place to move forward, aren't we? Yeah, I think next time we uh, jump ahead. Do we want to? What's the price of dry corn at the minute? Uh, have we actually got any? Yeah. In the silo? Uh, no, to sell it from the production. Okay. Uh, even, even, uh, yeah, 81 grand, 100 grand in Jan. You know, something to think about. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of, my brain's kind of cooked, so. <laughs> yeah, just like the rest of me, yeah. Yep, yes. I think we call it a day. And, uh, I think that's a good plan, mate. It's gone quick, that has. It has, it was a lot of fun. It was, indeed. I will see you next week. You will, all being well. Yep. Should Take be, care, I should mate. be okay. See ya. Cool. Bye. Bye.